Hi, I'm Matt with Appliancevideo.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at the electronic control on this Whirlpool Direct Drive washer with built-in faucet. Stop. Before beginning any repair, always be sure to disconnect the power to the appliance. It is also recommended to test the outlet for proper voltage. Remember to also turn off the water. A defective electronic control can cause a multitude of different failures. Most commonly, it will cause problems with the lid lock, uh, not sending power to the lid lock. Uh, the unit may be completely dead and won't power up at all. Or you could have problems with it not sending power down to the motor. To begin this repair, click on the link below to view this repair video. Appliancevideo.com guides you step by step giving you the confidence to avoid recalls and callbacks, also saving time on repairs. Whether you're up against an uncommon repair or the latest appliance on the market, our videos have been created with you in mind. Our growing library of videos have been produced using our factory certified technicians who have extensive infield experience over the past 30 years. Appliancevideo.com provides high quality repair videos that anyone can follow, regardless of their skill level. We are here to help. Click on the link below to view this repair video and let us help you do it right the first time.